Scottish Cup action for Elena Sedika's side as the holders take on Montrose in the Scottish Cup quarter final. Caitlin Hayes captains the side today. And Celtic look to book their place at Hamden in the semi final. Launched into the middle of the park, but won by Kavanagh. And Gallagher knocks that on to Lucia Ashworth Clifford, who squares it across the box. And what a finish from Kit Lefersky. On hand to direct that cross into the back of the net. And Celtic have an early lead. Ashworth Clifford back in the starting lineup last week and in with the assists this week. 1-0, Lefersky with the goal. Sydney Cummings to Kavanagh. He'll knock that towards Barclay. She'll send up the line, Jenny Smith will chase that. She's got the pace, she wins the ball. Cuts that inside to Amy Gallagher, back to Smith. Just a little bit too much on that, but Barclay works it across the box. Oh, and the cheeky touch comes in from Lefersky to double Celtic's advantage. Some wonderful forward play from Lefersky there. But credit has to go to the build-up on the right-hand side. Some wonderful link-up play and the ball in from Barclay was excellent. It's 2-0 now to Celtic. Shen floats the ball in. Hayes with the header and it just doesn't have enough on it to beat the goalkeeper and it's knocked away a good chance there I actually think it may have come off Barclay Gallica stands on the ball but she's able to retain possession oh a lovely nutmeg there from Clifford from Ashworth Clifford Caitlin Hayes now drives forward with the ball knocks it onto the right wing the back there will send it on to Jenny Smith. Wonderful play again, the right-hand side. The ball across. Gallica just couldn't reach it. Celtic looking really dangerous on the right wing today. Barkley with the header. Hayes wins the second contact. Drive that pass forward. Wonderful touch from Gallagher. He just looks to lift it over the keeper. I mean, Gallagher's looking sharp today. There was a real opportunity there to get her name on the score sheet. The touch is excellent. Just couldn't get enough height. Driving up the left wing. Knocks that ball inside to Gallagher. And she's got options. One of them is Jenny Smith. She tries to pick her out through the middle. She does. Smith must be 3 0. Wonderful attacking play again from Celtic. Kavanagh to Gallagher to Smith. And Smith makes absolutely no mistake. It's 3 0 now. And Celtic surely are in the semi final of the Scottish Cup. looking to find a way into this match but there's no route through as Celtic once again get onto the front foot Kit Lefersky with Jenny Smith in the box Smith with a chance now and she's dragged it just wide of the post well the pass inside was wonderful and actually it's a wonderful save from the Montrose keeper there Smith unlucky not to make it four Free kick sent into the area. Montrose unable to get it fully away. Ashworth Clifford with the shot. It's found its way to Hayes, but the keeper keeps it out. Well, Celtic with a good chance there. In the second half to make this 4 now. Maria McInerney floats that ball in deep. Hayes with the header. It's still up in there. A bit of pinball in the box, but it's 
smashed into the roof of the net. And this time it's Shen who gets her name on the score sheet. It's 4 0 to Celtic. And Elena Sadiku's side are enjoying themselves in the Scottish Cup quarter final. Macarena sends it through to Amy Gallagher. Keeps hold of the ball in the box. Back to Ashworth Clifford. Lafersky with the quick feet. She's driving towards the byline. And the defender has to be sharp to halt that attack from Lafersky. McCormick taking quickly. Here comes Ashworth Clifford with the ball. Whipped in. Off the inside of the post and just along the goal line. And Montrose are able to get it away well. It was a wonderful effort there from Ashworth Clifford. And she's very unfortunate not to have her name on the score sheet. McInerney with the ball into the box. It's accurate with pinpoint precision. The ball is delivered to Caitlin Hayes. And she makes it a five-star performance from Celtic today. A wonderful ball into the box and a glancing header into the back of the net. <laughs> Chloe Craig sends the ball to McInerney. Tash Flint, good turn, has the shot and good save from the keeper. You, we know how dangerous Tash Flint can be on the attack and from these positions she only had one thought in her mind and it was almost a wonderful goal there. McInerney sends it forward to Lefersky. She's been a thorn in the side of the Montrose defence all day and she's still driving on. She's into the area. Just to cut it back. It's just knocked away. Addy on the ball. Has a go and it's just wide of the post. Celtic don't look happy with five. They look like they're going for more here. Chloe Craig sends that ball forward and Ming Lu will give chase. She sends it across the face of goal. Agnew picks up and it must be six here. And it is six. A relentless performance from Elena Sedika's side here in the quarter final of the cup. It's six now to Celtic. And what a performance. Barkley on the ball, cuts inside to Smith, Chloe Craig with the captain's armband on, sends it on to Agnew, back to Barclay, the passing is wonderful from Celtic as Barclay advances into the area, she's into the penalty box, it's sent across the face of goal and it should have been seven, but Murphy Agnew just cannot divert that ball into the net as the full time whistle goes and Celtic are going back to Hamden. Celtic will be in the semi-final of the Scottish Cup. It finishes here, Montrose now, Celtic 6.